The director and dean of Oklahoma State Tech in Okmulgee, Wayne Miller. Quality vocational technical education is a missing link in higher education today. Modern technology, the backbone of the nation's economy, demands highly skilled craftsmen and industrial technicians in large number. The Oklahoma State University, through its vocational technical branch in Okmulgee, commonly referred to as Oklahoma State Tech, and through its technical institutes, is a national leader in post-secondary Votech work. This film takes you into only five of the 12 major departments on the Okmulgee campus. There are 52 career choices available at Oklahoma State Tech. In addition to extremely high quality vocational technical education, Tech offers benefits of college campus life, residence halls, fine food, a sports program, and friendship of 2,600 students from 77 Oklahoma counties, 33 states, and 10 foreign countries. Visitors are always welcome. The closely related fields of industrial electronics, industrial instrumentation, and industrial electrical maintenance prepare students at Oklahoma State Tech in Okmulgee for entry into the complex fields utilizing electronics, automation, and instrumentation. Students receive training through an intensive study of the theory and practical application of basic electronic circuits and the complex systems which use these circuits. Six trimester courses of 16 weeks are required to complete electronic studies at Oklahoma State Tech. These courses can be completed in two years. The overall objective in electrical maintenance is to turn out a commercial electrician. The theory of layout and electrical wiring methods and techniques are studied to meet the requirements of the National Electrical Code for Residential and Small Business Wiring. The first unit of study is electrical fundamentals. Here the student receives basic theories and principles of electricity. This provides a firm foundation for study in all phases of the electrical and electronic fields. Shop work requires the students to put these theories and principles into practice as he studies them. A study unit entitled Power and Process Control is a survey coverage of the most commonly used motors, generators, and associated controls. This is augmented by basic hydraulic and pneumatic principles. The unit on residential and wiring code is designed to acquaint the student with residential wiring in accordance with the National Electrical Code. Blueprint reading symbols and correct wiring techniques are emphasized. Proper industrial wiring methods and techniques are learned in the unit on industrial wiring and code. Oklahoma State Tech students do not specialize during their two-year course work. During this time, the student is given a broad and basic background. He may then choose his field of specialization. Today's technology is changing rapidly. Today's machines may be obsolete tomorrow, but with the foundation given by coursework, the graduate student will have the basic knowledge to handle changes in the industry. New skills are continually being developed by future technicians to accompany the specialized instruction in servicing and troubleshooting. Oklahoma State Tech is truly a leader in the vocational technical education field because of the basic concept of learning by doing. Tech is designed to serve that area of industry lying between the semi-skilled craftsmen and the engineering technicians. Employers know Oklahoma State Tech graduates have the necessary skills for today's as well as tomorrow's jobs. Courses in food trades at Oklahoma State Tech in Okmulgee help prepare students for one of the fastest growing industries in the United States. New hotels, motels, and restaurants are being constructed every day to cater to the needs of the American public. Experts estimate that 10,000 cooks could find jobs tomorrow. At Oklahoma State Tech, 
culinary art students receive their training in a model restaurant that has the finest equipment available. In the pastry cook unit of instruction, the student develops skill in making pies, cake fillings, decorations, variety breads, and specials. Special emphasis is placed on nutrition, care of equipment, and sanitation. An educational unit entitled Salad and Pantry gives the student experience in the preparation of beverages, appetizers, sandwiches, and salads. In this unit, the student prepares dressings and garnishments for cold meats, frozen desserts, and salads. In the stewardship unit, the student assumes the role of the chef. He gains skill in supervising the menu preparation, food service, food purchasing, storeroom procedures, care and use of equipment, and personnel management. Units are also taught on dinner and fry cook, meat cutting, food laboratory, and cake decoration. In the cake decorating unit, the student gains skills in the preparation of icings and cakes for special occasions. Students are instructed in decorative writings, making borders, tube selection, color blending, and designs. Four trimesters are offered at Oklahoma State Tech centered around baking. The baking field employs more people than any other phase of the food industry. Approximately 41 million loaves of bread are baked daily in bakeries in the United States. The student receives training in all phases of the baking industry at Oklahoma State Tech. Baking units are divided into eight sections, including baking theory, where the student studies production, processing, and mixing of the various ingredients used in bakery production. In the bread and roll production unit, the student develops skill in hand and machine makeup of variety breads, dinner rolls, and buns. In studying cake decoration, the student works with all types of decorative icings, sugar molds, lattice designs, and flowers. Practical application of decorating techniques are used in making birthday, special occasion, and wedding cakes. Finished pastry and bread products are distributed through the baked food sales store and the college cafeteria. Students, faculty, and staff, and the general public are allowed to use the retail outlet store. At this store, numerous items are for sale and special orders are filled. A delicious smorgasbord feast is made available each Thursday to the fortunate students, staff, and general public. The smorgasbord gives the students an opportunity to put into practice their learning. Much preparation goes into the meal, which features about 90 different foods and is very attractively displayed with elaborate decorations, including ice carvings, molded salads, and many garnished dishes. Their labors are a delight to all who partake of the smorgasbord each Thursday. Oklahoma State Tech graduates have little trouble in finding positions in the food industry. Commercial art and printing, communication tools that complement one another, make up creative and technical coursework for students at Oklahoma State Tech. Commercial art instruction gives students basics of mechanical or paste-up artwork in a one-year, three-trimester course. A two-year, six-trimester course adds instruction in design to the basic course. Students at the Okmulgee Institution are prepared to accept an idea and develop this idea into a visual form of communication. Commercial art students are trained to fill positions as staff artists in corporation art departments, advertising agencies, or art studios. Students who finish the one and two year courses find employment waiting throughout Oklahoma, the Southwest, and Midwest region. Students involved in commercial art training study various phases of art production, plus related academic courses in business principles and law, English, and human relations. Tech's commercial art reputation has resulted in enrollment by students from across Oklahoma and throughout the Midwest and Southwest. Much of that reputation is based on the practical experience that accompanies classroom learning. Putting skills to work 
OST students designed their yearbook, The Technician, as well as the institution's letterheads, insignia, and program materials. While printed communication tools are designed by the artist, it takes the printer to get them on paper. Tech's printing curriculum is designed to give students experiences and techniques in mass media printing systems now used by the industry. The philosophy behind this type of training is to provide students with knowledge and skills that will permit them to do any type of work a customer in a commercial print shop might require, and to instill in the student the ability to adapt to changes in this rapidly changing business. Industrial print shops, commercial businesses, and newspapers are demanding skilled employees who are well trained in printing techniques. It takes five trimesters, almost two years, to complete most of Tech's printing courses. And lest we think of printing as a dirty, messy occupation that requires male strength, women are encouraged to enter the field and have the abilities to easily learn the techniques to fill jobs in offset printing. Lithography, or offset printing, courses give students the basics of copy preparation, camera, and press operation. Letterpress coursework involves elementary printing. This includes learning type cases and correct spacing through hand-feeding open presses and basic make-ready procedures. Tech students implement classroom instruction with practical experience, printing the school's calendars, brochures, catalogs, theater tickets, and yearbook. OST's printing curriculum stresses practical experience, an Oklahoma State Tech trademark, and this practical experience complements the commercial arts students' instruction and experience. This gives graduates of each curriculum earning power to take into life. Business education at Oklahoma State Tech in Okmulgee isn't just a series of how-to courses. Oklahoma State Tech's Business Education Department offers courses in three fields of study, clerical, general business, and accounting. There are more women than men in Tech's Business Education Department, but men do make up a fair share of the program. An office operates efficiently when secretarial employees are well-trained and able to do the right job the first time. Tech's clerical courses follow the institution's year-round trimester system and stress personality development as well as office skills. Designed to prepare women for employment in large and small businesses, OST requires each student to spend at least 240 hours learning the techniques of operating various business machines, plus basics of shorthand and typing. Then students are given practical training to put theory and experience to work to do a job in business, while at the same time refining skills. The functions of an office worker in today's business industry requires more than just knowledge of office practices. And tech augments training for particular business skills with courses in personality development. For women, personality development covers various facets of hygiene and grooming, including proper dress, use of cosmetics, sitting, walking, and etiquette. There are also hints in weight control. And the students are given instructions on in how to make coffee, a near necessity in U.S. business today. Personality development for men is called executive training and encompasses corresponding courses for males. For men and women interested in tax accounting and computer courses, a mathematical background is helpful. Also, a logical thinking person is best suited for the positions in business, and students are counseled and tested before enrolling in this phase of business education. Instruction in Tech's Computer Center gives students skills to take into the rapidly changing and increasing computer field to become computer operators, programmers, or to fill positions in systems work. Accounting students can take positions with large and small businesses as bookkeepers and business managers. 
Tech's general business curriculum follows a theme of providing training for various positions in the field of commerce. And as in the clerical and accounting fields, general business's curriculum includes courses in oral communications, English, psychology, human relations, plus other related general education subjects. All help prepare students to become salesmen, merchandisers, buyers, or advertising and sales promotion men. Opportunities for Oklahoma State Tech students finishing coursework in business, accounting, and clerical programs are growing as business and industry grow the demands for qualified employees increase with that growth. During the two-year diesel and farm machinery course at Oklahoma State Tech in Okmulgee, students receive practical training in all phases of maintenance and repair of many types of diesel-powered equipment with which they'll be in daily contact after graduation. The demand for diesel mechanics has created many opportunities for employment in this field. At OST, all training and procedures are based on accepted practices and standards of industry. During recent years, more and more heavy equipment has become diesel operated. At Tech, units listed under diesel mechanics are designed to give the student a good understanding of the operation and overhaul of diesel and other heavy equipment. To capitalize on learning by doing, students work with actual heavy equipment on typical jobs similar to those they will encounter upon entering the field of competitive diesel mechanics. The development of correct work habits and attitudes, as well as mechanical and technical skills, is stressed. Classroom space at OST takes up 70,000 square feet and accommodates a current enrollment of about 350. Six regular classrooms are maintained and each has its own lab. In each of the six trimesters, the student spends about one-fourth of the time in the classroom and the other three-fourths in the laboratory shop. During the two-year course at Tech, the student receives instructions in most phases of diesel. In the engine principles and accessories unit, the student becomes acquainted with engine displacement, combustion requirements, thermal efficiency, and disassembly and assembly of small high-speed diesel engines. One instructional unit deals with transmissions, final drives, clutches, brakes, and hydraulics. In this unit, the student learns to disassemble, repair, and assemble. Now, this gives knowledge of operation, defects, their causes, and corrections. One unit of study deals with electrical systems and teaches necessary electrical details involved in maintenance and repair of starters, generators, regulators, switches, and wiring circuits on battery and magnetotype ignition systems and carburation of gasoline and LP engines. In the fuel injection unit, the student develops skill in disassembling, testing, and operation of fuel injection equipment. In transportation air conditioning, the student's time is spent in the fundamentals of repairing, servicing, and troubleshooting the refrigeration systems used in the trucking industry. One instructional unit is devoted to engine overhaul. This phase acquaints the students with the overhaul procedures on all types of construction, highway, and stationary type engines. And the final unit is customer overhaul. This unit is a review of the first five trimesters of study, and students here are involved in actual shop practices. State and commercial vehicles are overhauled. Trucks and buses, oil field drilling units, irrigation units, and all types of industrial equipment. Tech diesel graduates are much in demand throughout the United States. Employers know Oklahoma State Tech graduates have the necessary skills for today's as well as tomorrow's jobs. 